thank you. Uh, can you hear me well? Can I start now? Yes. Thank yes. you. Thank you very much indeed, uh, <clears throat> dear ladies and gentlemen. It's quite an honor to be able to address you from uh, Geneva, Switzerland, uh, on behalf of the United Nations and of UNITAR. Uh, as I, I guess you know, I am a director at a UN agency called UNITAR. I work closely with Peter and his team to advance sustainable development, to do whatever it needs to be done. So by the year 2030, we have a better world. We actually achieve the SDGs. But um, I have been tasked today with um, the very uh, much honor of congratulating the SDG champions uh, in this uh, certificate uh, presentation ceremony on behalf of UNITAR and C5 Flanders. So let me do so by explaining two or three things very fast. Number one is that uh, the sustainable development is a concept that has transformed our um, uh, world and will continue to transform it. And uh, as I speak to you, we are very happy that some things are improving, but we are also in need of more help. The SDGs are not advancing at the speed that we would like them to advance. So we need more champions, champions like you today receiving this recognition and this certificate with the United Nations and the UNITAR logo. We need more champions like Peter Waller, my colleague that has the, is dedicating his life to actually make the world better. But at the same time that I talked to you about that, I wanted to tell you that we have this network of 31 training centers, including the one in Antwerp that Peter leads called the CIFA Global Network. And I want to invite you to work with us beyond what Peter does. This is truly a global network that uh, is uh, actually creating high impact. So in trying to uh, present this invitation to you so you can join us, I have to say, uh, because uh, I have to do some justice, that particularly in Europe, but beyond as well. In Europe, CIFA Flanders has been one of the exemplary centers in this quest to make our world better. CIFAR Flanders has become a center of reference in this uh, global network, and the expertise of CIFAR Flanders on the Sustainable Development Goals actually makes a humongous difference. And I tell you that because CIFAR Flanders has given to Belgium, to Flanders first, then to Belgium, then to Europe, and then to the world, this methodology of this uh, trajectory of uh, PCA 2030 sustainability. I want you to know, dear friends, dear colleagues, that what you are witnessing today in uh, Belgium is something that is in the process of being exported uh, from Belgium to the world. Uh, you are serving as an example. You are motivating many people uh, uh, around the world, particularly in developing nations, to become champions for sustainable development and eventually ambassadors for that. So as we celebrate this remarkable achievement, I want to express our sincere appreciation to the province of Antwerp and to Blue Gate Antwerp Development uh, as uh, they have uh, indeed shown in a tangible way why they should receive this certificate. This uh, PCA 2030 trajectory play a role in shaping a better future uh, towards sustainable development in the region that you um, uh, lead. The province of the Antwerp, of course, will always be important for the United Nations, and we have gotten to know it thanks to the many friends that we have in Antwerp. Um, finally, I think that it's important to say that uh, the province of Antwerp has uh, uh, truly demonstrated an outstanding dedication to implementing the SDGs across all governance levels from the Provincial Council to every one of their staff members. Their inclusive approach to decision-making and extensive engagement with international uh, issues, and most important with local domestic issues, uh, indeed uh, serve as an example for other similar entities. And uh, in um, recognizing them, I also have to tell you that um, as they will continue in this journey to become SDG ambassadors, and to pursue in full the PCA 2030 trajectory, they will be changing their society. They will be making it better. They will be uh, showing best practices and implementation of public policy. 
that is exemplary for the rest of the countries, the rest of the world. Finally, uh, the case of Blue Gate Antwerp development, uh, they also deserve a recognition from the United Nations and from UNITAR because they have indeed showcased outstanding leadership in transforming a brownfield into a sustainable business area. Their sustainable development plan, stakeholder engagement exercises, and alignment with the SDGs exemplify their dedication to inclusive decision making and sustainable practices. The recent launch of the CSR report aligned with the SDGs at the EU CSRD that you all know further underscores their commitment to transparency and accountability. So to Blue Gate Antwerp, to the province of Antwerp, our sincere recognition uh, for all what you have done already and for what you are going to do. And as I come from Latin America and I speak Spanish, allow me to finish by telling you two things in my mother tongue. Felicitaciones y muchas gracias. Back to you, Peter.